the question we are solving now belongs to test series 1 it is of network theory subject in specific it belongs to sinusoidal steady state analysis as per the question there is a ac circuit given which contains a voltage source of 2 sin 2 t volts and a 1 ohm resistor and 0.5 henry inductor the circuit also contains a load impedance Z and there is a Y connection that is present as shown in the circuit and the Y connection contains one resistor and two capacitors. The resistors a resistor has a resistance of one ohm and capacitor has a capacitance of one by four farad. It's given that Z is purely resistive. We need to find the value of the impedance if the maximum power is transferred to the circuit. We need to find the value of Z such that maximum power is transferred to the circuit. From this we see that the given circuit operates at an angular frequency of omega equal to 2 radians per second. Upon replacing the inductances and capacitances by their corresponding impedances, we see that the circuit is excited by two phase zero volts at omega equal to two radians per second. And there is a one ohm resistor and the inductor show that is being drawn has an impedance of J omega L which is equal to J ohms and the load impedance is Z the resistor has an impedance of 1 ohm and the capacitor has an impedance of minus J2 ohm this is because capacitor's impedance is given by 1 by J omega C similarly the other capacitor which has a capacitance of 1 by 4 farad has an impedance of minus J2 ohm so this is the equivalent circuit in phasor form now we need to find the jet such that the maximum power is transferred to the circuit for doing the same we have to draw the equivalent circuit by replacing the voltage sources by short and the current sources by open upon doing the same we see that the equivalent circuit can be drawn as shown in the figure so there is an impedance of 1 plus j1 ohm and the voltage source is replaced by short and the Y connection is remains as shown now we see that for maximum power transfer to the circuit Z should be equal to Z TH sorry apps of Z TH now we see that the Z TH can be written as 1 plus J1 in parallel with 1 minus j1 this is because of the reason that minus j2 in parallel with minus j2 boils down to 1 minus j1 which is in series with 1 so we can see that jth can be written as 1 plus j1 in parallel with the 1 minus j1 as shown so this upon simplification becomes 1 plus j1 multiplied by 1 minus j1 divided by 1 plus j1 plus 1 minus j1 so we see that this is equal to 2 divided by 2 that is equal to 1 ohm from this we see that for maximum power transfer to the circuit z is equal to apps of z th is equal to 1 ohm also please note that even if the load is purely not resistive for maximum power transfer Z is equal to Z T H star is equal to 1 ohm please note that in the current problem let the load be purely resistive or not purely resistive the load impedance for the maximum power transfer can be expressed as 1 ohm hence the correct option is D